guys welcome back to no catchy name it's me ella today is tuesday november 2nd <laughs> and i have a little dollar tree haul i wanted to share with you guys it's craft related but it's not crochet related um and then i'm gonna do a little craft with me and it's just me making something you guys can watch i don't know if it's gonna be fun <laughs> but i went to dollar tree because i packed up all my halloween stuff and i wanted some christmas flowery things to set around uh for decoration <laughs> so um i bought some stuff for that and also bought some random stuff so i'll show you the random stuff first but my dollar tree randomly has these little glass bottles in there different sizes got little tiny ones and medium ones and i did buy a pack of the bigger ones but jesse opened them and took some of them so i got these for something i'm not sure i wanted some and then they were sold out so when i seen them this time i grabbed them in case i want to make something with them <laughs> eventually but they'd be cute for little potions bottles and things like that and um, I'll maybe use these in the future in a craft project. I don't know. But they, they are glass. And um, Jesse lost a cork out of one. But there's two of the larger ones. And those are neat though. I also got Jesse one of these ornaments. Because uh, the girl that I babysit got one on Halloween at a trunk or treat. And he wanted one. And I, I just happened to see him. And uh, got one. <laughs> Which is a cool ornament. Alright, now for the craft. <laughs> So I bought some florals, flower, florals, plastic, whatever, <laughs> flowers, and um, I don't know, I've not really done a lot of floral arranging, so I don't know how this is going to go, but I bought two sprigs with the pine cones and little glitter berries, <laughs> two sprigs of the berries, just by themselves, two sprigs, is that what they're called, I don't know of poinsettias that are like velvety and they got a little bit of gold on them but they're pretty and then these two things <laughs> of gold glittery things <laughs> i don't know what they're called so that's the floral that i bought to try to make these little arrangements with i don't speak flower making i also bought two of these little round foam flower things and two of these really cute Christmas buckets. They look like Santa. Oh, those are so cute. And these little um, floral things happen to fit right down in there like perfectly. So that's nice. So that's what I'm going to make my craft with. These floral sprig thingies. I don't know what they're called. What did they say on there? Uh, I don't know those things <laughs> and my little buckets I thought I'd make two and then they had a ton of stuff so if I um if I do good and I want to make more I can go back and buy more I was hoping they'd get some more of these little buckets but different ones like snowmen or something but it, I don't think it would be too hard to repaint them because you can tell that they're hand painted probably in China yep China <laughs> um so I'm sure you could just paint all right over them with your own colors yeah, so that's what I'm going to try to do. So first I'm going to open up these things, get the plastic off of them, and I will cut all these loose with my gate cutters. I don't know the proper terms for any of this stuff. I'm just crafting by the seat of my pants, but I thought I'd bring you guys along. I'm going to angle the camera differently and you can watch me attempt to uh, arrange these. I don't know what I'm doing, <laughs> but I thought it'd be fun. And maybe I'll learn something. Maybe you'll learn something. Maybe you could teach me something. <laughs> I don't know, but I'm going to get these things opened and we're going to get started. Spoiler alert, there'll probably be Christmas music playing over this. <laughs> Thank you. 